Hey guys, Rhino here. Welcome back to Pokemon Emerald. And today we're taking on the third member of the Elite Four. They look like an ice type trainer. I don't have a fire type, so I might be slightly screwed, but it could be a way to, like, when I fight Steven eventually later on. So I don't have a fire type for that either. But before we get into this third of four battles before we take on the champion, let's have a look at the team we're taking into today. And up front, starting the battles off today, is Dodge, my shiny Surviper. She's level 56 with Strength, Crunch, Earthquake, Poison Tail. Then we have my boy Thunder, the Mighty Anna, level 58 with Return, Rock Smash, Shaker Power and Crunch. We have more of the Zoomerill with Dive, Rollout, Surf, Waterfall, which I'm running out of, but I have other water type moves, so we should be okay with that one. Then we have Arrow, the Agron, level 57 with Rollout, Thunder, Metal Claw and Ice Beam. We have Tap, the Flygon, who's, who's literally like 2 XP from leveling up. It is really annoying. And I have Crunch, Fly, Steel, Wing, and Dragon Breath. Then we have level 56, Trekking the Sotile with Detect, Flash, Leaf Blade, and Cut. And look at the XP. Look at that XP bar on the bottom. It is one bar from leveling up. I got blue balls by Phoebe last time. And now today we are taking on... Welcome, my name is Glacier of the Elite Four. I've traveled from... I've traveled afar to Hoenn so I can hone my ice skills. What I, all I have seen are challenges by weak trainers and their pathetic Pokemon. What about you? It would please me if, to no end if I could go all out against you. You know what? I like ice types. I feel like they're underrated. I think next Pokemon game, I definitely want to use an ice type. If I can find one. I think last year. A Sailiel. Okay, level 50, so we're catching up to my level. I don't know how to feel about that. Let's go for a strength, though. We're not, not wasting any time here, we're going straight into the offensive moves. Hail! Okay, it started to hail. Hail continues to fall, so that'll boost ice type moves. Is it going to damage me at all? Dodge is pelted by hail, but Celio isn't, that is unfair. Poison tail time. Kind of poison the Celio. The big chunky boy. Chunky girl, I should say. Now looking at the, um, I was uh, misgendering there, I apologise. Body, oh come on, no! No, no, no! Not a good start, not a good start, not a good start, not a good start, not a good start. Dodge is being pelted by hail. It's like we're in Oklahoma or something. Anyway, crunch time. Come on, come, come on, come through, Dodge. Oh, Dodge got rid of the uh, paralysis because it shed skin. Thank you, come through with the crit. Let's go, Dodge. Dodge's not messing it out today. She is pissed. How to use a Glalie? Hmm. You know what? I would like to use some rollouts. I feel like rock types are good against ice. I don't know why, I just feel like I've remembered that from somewhere. A Glalie. I don't think it's part flying though. Am I going to get pelted by hail? More is pelted by hail. Right, rollouts. Ice beam. Don't freeze me, please. Please don't freeze me. Please don't freeze me. Please don't freeze me. That's very effective. I'm not frozen. Roll out, let's go. Let's go, what are we going to do here? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Super effective, just as I thought. Hail continues to pelt Paul Moore. He's going to use Crunch, okay. Where do you find these Ice type Pokemon? I haven't met one yet, obviously apart from the ones I'm fighting right now, but you know what I mean. Big rollout coming, big rollout coming. Okay, so they're going to heal. The hail has stopped, good, good, good. If I can get off this next rollout, I might effectively one shot the Glalie. Come on more, come on more, come on more, big rollout, let's go. Let's go with the big rollout. Can we one shot it now? Can we one shot it now? <laughs> oh, so close! I'm gonna waste a rollout on this thing now again as well. I'm unhappy about that. More use rollout, <laughs> big rollout. Oh, that was the big finale as well. Oh, that is, that is infuriating, but it's okay. Glalie's gone 2000 XP, I'm happy about that though. Another freaking Celio. Now then, do I risk Trekkie? I think I do. We, I mean, we can super effective each other in this fight. So that probably evens it out. Leaf Blade, please be quicker. I am quicker. Good, 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 good. How much damage are we going to do? Oh, okay. Critical hit. Let's go, Trekkie. Let's go. That is what I need from you right now. 1400 XP, even better. A Walren. I will stay out for the Warren. Oh, level 53. We're basically on level now. I'm, I'm still quicker. Good. Trekkie be a quick boy. Trekkie be a very quick boy. 
What are we gonna do? Can we one shot this? Oh, I was I was hoping there for a second. Ice beam. I was hoping for a second, maybe. Please live. Please live. Please live. It did. Good. Good job, Trekkie. Good job. And now they're not gonna heal because of the citrus berry. Leaf Blade, let's go. Let's go. Take out the Warren. Can we get a level up from taking out this thing? It is so bulky as well. I hope we get a level up. Let's go, Trekkie. Goodbye, Warren. We get over 2,000 XP, all so close to a level up. Another Glalie. Right then, I think it is time now to use Aro for this final fight. And now then, Glalie meet a rollout. I'm just gonna just wanna lock in the same the same moves we did before, you know. Oh, that was a big rollout. Okay, it's gonna start to hile again. Hail continues to fall and he's going to pelt Arrow. He's going to dent his armour. 10 damage. That was more than I was expecting, actually. You know? I thought he'd do a little bit less than that. But it doesn't matter because Glalie is no more. Goodbye. Goodbye, Glalie. 2,000 XP. Let's go. We defeated Glacier. You and your Pokemon. How hot your spirits burn. The all-consuming heat overwhelms. Oh. There is no surprise that my icy skills fail to ha you. You harm me in ways you cannot imagine. You 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 failed to let me level up. Uh, tap. Advance to the next room. Is that what you're going to say to me? And there, confirm that you're truly fit on side of the Pokemon League. You know what? I've got a feeling the next type's going to be Dragon. I don't know why. I don't know why is Dragon weak to. Dragon's weak to Fairy, but do Fairy types exist yet? I don't know. Anyway, healing time. Where are my? Now, I don't use hyper potions. Where are my super potions at? Here we go. Now, let's use one arrow to get those 10 HP back. I, I'm not messing around in the Elite Four. Let's use another one. Another two on more. I need another one. Let's burn through these items because I'm not going to need them after this. Let's use this one on Treki. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised Treki survived the Ice Beam. I'm, 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 I'm very happy about it, though. And let's use one on dodge. There we go. Oh, I've got a little bit more still to use on Trekkie. That's fine. I don't mind burning one for 6 HP. And now, this is dragon types next time. Tap is part dragon. But I feel like dragon moves are super effective against dragons for some reason. Maybe that's just what Pokemon Go's taught me. So I'm going to switch tap up to the front because not getting this level up is really going to annoy me otherwise. And I'm going to switch Trekkie into second place. So I want to use him next time. I started Pokemon and deserves a bit more a bit more love, you know, in the Elite Four. And in we go. This so looks like a dragon type room. Or a sailor, so I don't know. Maybe it's a water type, but we've already had an ice type. That's near enough the same. But that is where I'm going to leave things for today. So if you enjoyed this episode of Pokemon Emerald, then please leave a like on the video. You can't down below. Subscribe if you need to hit notification bell so you don't miss any future videos, which will be on a Monday and Friday for definite Wednesdays if I can. I do work full time, so can't guarantee it's three videos a week, but definitely Monday and Friday. And sometimes select Saturdays as well for Formula 1 and Formula 2. About every month or so, the WWE 2K20 series makes its return for the pay per view events, with the in between Raw and SmackDown episodes results being posted on my Twitter and Instagram. So definitely give me a follow on there so, you, so the pay per views make more sense. As well as if I need to make updates about anything as well. New updates when videos are released, announcements for that. And since you're watching this video, I'm going to assume you like Pokemon. And on my Instagram, I post updates to my Pokemon card collection, which I've been collecting now for over 11 years. I have at least 4,000 cards in my collection. Some pretty good ones as well, you know, like a Pikachu Gold Star, Shiny Charizard from Plasma Storm, or one of them sets anyway. The secret rare shiny one. And yeah, sealed products such as booster boxes and sealed packs, including in an EX Crystal Guardians pack from 2006. So, if you want to see all this in my collection and, and you enjoy the shiny cardboard as well, then definitely give me a follow on Instagram so you don't miss out on that. So, in the next episode, we take on the final member of the Elite Four, this sailor dude with a really, really magnificent moustache. I feel like he's going to be a dragon type trainer, I'm calling it now. And when we defeat him next time. There's only one more thing to do. Well, actually, there's quite a few more things to do. But first of all, we have to become the champion of this region. But yeah, that's all going to be in a future episode. So that's where I'm going to leave things for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.